To loop playback in DaVinci Resolve, the first thing you need to do is click this loop playback button, or alternatively on a PC, hold down control and hit the forward slash key on the keyboard to either enable or disable it. On a Mac, this would be command forward slash. Now this will actually work, but what it will do by default is it will just loop around the timeline. If I play this back, watch what happens when the playhead gets to the end, it loops back to the start of the timeline. If you actually want to loop playback on a specific part of the video, the first thing you need to do is set an in point where you want it to start looping. You can do this by hitting I on the keyboard and then setting an out point by hitting O on the keyboard. But if you try and click play or hit the space bar, notice this is not actually going to loop around. To actually get this to loop, what you need to do is either come to the playback menu, come down to the play around two menu option and choose play in to out. Alternatively, you can hold down alt and hit forward slash. Watch what happens when this gets to the out point. Notice it starts looping between the in and out points. On a Mac, the equivalent keyboard shortcut is option forward slash. And when you finish looping playback, hold down alt or option and hit the X key on the keyboard.